Johnny me escucha. Sí, teacher. Ah, ok, very good. Es que me salió una notificación que no, no estaba grabando audio, pero sí me escucha bien. Hace poquito, no, pero ahora sí. Ah, bye, chivo. All right, very good. Ya regreso, Johnny. Gracias. Hi, Marco. Hi, good evening. How are you? Um, so, so tired, but... Yeah. I'm rest the car in, and that we travel with my uh, co-workers. Uh-huh. Uh, fail when... Uh, in the morning. Okay. Um, no sé, me tocó. All right, yeah. Y uh, for coming to the house. Uy. I coming. But Marco, uh, you live you live in uh you say you live in El Congo. El Congo City, yeah. All right, uh, okay. And you work where? Um, I work in American Park. Okay. Yes, up to 50 minutes. Okay. 50 yeah. Minutes. But right. in the afternoon, the traffic is very annoying. It's it's heavy. It's heavy. Yeah. Oh wow. It's okay. Heavy. Um. Sometimes, uh, the police, the the police, uh, help to to evacuate the, the traffic, but uh -huh. sometimes don't do it and. It's a habit. Oh my goodness. All right. Okay. All right. Just and give me a couple of days that we travel to San Salvador uh -huh. with my worker, uh, Albert. Yes. Good evening. Some days, uh, a few months ago, uh, when coming to the house in the afternoon, we the La Bajada de los Chorros. Uh -huh. Or two hours, three hours to come into 
Okay. Yeah. It's only for coming. All right. It's crazy, eh? Yes. Okay, very good. All right. Give me a second, guys. Give me a second, guys, please. All right, very good. Okay, so I see Jorge, uh, Daniel, Mariano, Carla. Jory, of course, Amilcar. Hi, Amilcar. Good evening. Francisco, Trini. Very nice. All right. ¿O ya está mejor, Amilcar? ¿Cada vez mejor? ¿Sí? Sí, ya mejor. Ayer tuve una recaída, teacher. Y estuve bastante malo, por eso no, no me pude conectar. Sí. Mm. Ok. Pero hoy sí, ya vamos en el camino correcto. Ok, <laughs> me alegra. Very nice. Thank you. All right, very good, guys. So yesterday, uh, we began the unit two, okay? And we were talking about simple present, remembering and reviewing simple present tenses, all right? So that's what we did yesterday. Today, we are going to continue talking about simple present, but using the model of see, uh, the adverbs of frequency. All right, so let me just get the um the book here so we can start. Let's see. Hi, Carlos or Alberto. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Yeah. I'm very well. Excellent. Glad to hear. All right, so as I said, we're going to continue with um, present simple or simple present and, and the adverbs of frequency, okay? Ayer leímos, estábamos leyendo un poco de la conversación antes de retirarnos de clase ayer. All right, it says listen to your teacher. All right, ayer lo leímos, creo que un par de ustedes lo leyeron. All right, so here it says, hello, Jennifer, how is it going? All right, acuérdense que how is it going? It's another way to ask, how are you? Solo que un poquito más, no informal, pero es como más de every day. Usted le dice, hey, Marco, how's it going? Or, um, Daniel, how's it going? And es, no es que sea malo, solo que es un poquito menos formal. ¿verdad? So how is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. All right. Acuérdese que the pronunciation of just, just checking. All right. No decimos just, it's just checking the number. All right. Luego tenemos, we have the expression regular basis. What is regular basis? Do we understand that expression? Do you understand regular basis? Anybody? Um, no. No picture. All right. Anybody else? No, nobody knows what regular basis are. All right. It's mm -hmm. como similar to a routine. For example, you say on a regular ba basis, I have meetings. Es algo que suele pasar bien seguido, all right? Por ejemplo, usted es un cliente frecuente del, I don't know, del comedor X o de alguna cafetería, all right? You go there on a regular basis. Just give me a second. All right? Entonces, es como cuando usted va ahí bien seguido, all right? Entonces, por eso dice, hey, I'm just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis, all right? So like they come ev almost every day. That sounds good. Look, I'm thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things, all right? La palabra estrategia is strategies, all right? That is the pronunciation. All right, then we have, tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. 
However, we're promoting a, a dessert every week. All right. And then do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Okay, now, la palabra dessert. Do we understand dessert? Yes, no? <laughs> ah, okay. The cert is yes. Uh, acabo de ver algo así. Uh, un paredado. Señor. No sé. No. ¿Cómo que perdone? Uh, La transferida el sistema de correo de voz. Oh. <laughs> All right, so dessert is like cheesecake or quesadilla or budin or ice cream. That's dessert. Okay. Yes, it is a postre. All right, a delicious dessert. Yes. Sí, es que lo recordaba porque estaba viendo un video donde daban la diferencia entre dessert y dessert. Dessert, yes. Ajá. Dessert <laughs> es el desierto, ¿verdad? Y dessert es el postre. Very nice. Uh, All right. Very good, guys. So here we have. Ah, y luego termina con el item. Acuérdense que ese no es item, es item. All right. Yeah. And then she says, no, sir, we never do. Okay. Now, here, if you notice, we have, in bold, we have these words. Often, seldom, never. A eso le llamamos adverse of frequency. Ok. Now, antes de empezar por acá, los tenemos, eh, aquí tenemos, like, a little bit more of them. Before we begin, I want you to answer question number one and question number two. What kind of restaurant do you think Jennifer manages? What restaurant is this? Is this a Mexican restaurant? Is this, um, I don't know, is it a, a cafeteria, what is it? What kind of restaurant is it? It's our cafeteria. Okay. <laughs> All right, Amilcar, it sounds more like a cafeteria. Any other ideas? No? What type of restaurant do you think it is? Uh-huh. Bakery. A bakery. Okay, maybe, maybe it's a bakery. All right, yeah, could be. Anything yes. else? Yes, because they have menu and <laughs> uh -huh. about the change of menu. Yeah, okay, all right, very nice. Okay, and then here we have also, uh, for number two, it says, what are some marketing strategies the mm -hmm. restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients. What are some strategies that they are using? Acuérdense que ella menciona algunas, all right? What are the strategies? Uh -huh. Let's see, everybody, tell me some strategies that they're using, please. Everglade. Excuse me? Let me say, uh, from never, we are promoting Everglade, no. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, so lo que esa no sería una estrategia. De hecho, ella le pregunta, do we give promotional items? Y ella le dice que no. But there are some strategies. ¿Cuál sería otra estrategia? Uh, promotional item. Yes, they promote a dessert every week. Excellent. They promote a dessert every week. All right, that's what they they do as a strategy, all right? They promote they promote a dessert and they change the menu. All right? Also, that's another strategy para no servir lo mismo y lo mismo y lo mismo, all right? So they have different menus here. All right. Veamos entonces. Here we have Here we have how to use adverbs of frequency. 
patterns of frequency indicate how often an action takes place. Maria Melina, can you please read this adverse of frequency for me, please? Always. Always. Mm -hmm. Seldom. Rarely. Sometimes. Hardly. Hardly ever. And never. Very good. Thank you, Maria Melina. So we have always, seldom, rarely, sometimes, hardly ever, and never. A ver. Which one is 100%, guys? Always. That's right. Always is 100%. Which one is never? Which percent do you give to never? And never. Zero percent, yes. So it's the opposite. Always is 100% and never is zero percent. What about sometimes? Sometimes. 50%. 50, yes. 50. Okay, entonces aquí tenemos el extremo, always is 100, never is zero, sometimes is 50. What is the percentage for rarely? What is the percentage for rarely? 25. Okay, sure. All right, and seldom? 10%. Uh -huh. ¿Cuánto le darían? ¿Cuánto porcentaje le damos a seldom? Seldom, 80%. Maybe an 80%, okay. All right, what about... Uh -huh. Tisha, what is meaning seldom? Ah, that's what I wanna I want to get to. All right, primero vamos a ver los porcentajes y después vamos a ver eh, what they actually mean. All right. What about hardly okay. ever? Ya vamos a llegar a eso, Emilina. Very good. What about okay. hardly ever? Hardly ever twenty five percent. Okay. All right. Entonces. Vamos a ver aquí. De hecho, eh, digamos que en los extremos tenemos always, never, and sometimes. Seldom, rarely, hardly ever. Son como los porcentajes bien parecidos, ¿verdad? Están debajo del sometimes. ¿Ok? Entonces, usted puede jugar con casi nunca, rara vez. Y seldom también quiere decir rara vez o casi nunca. Entonces, se vuelve un sinónimo. ¿All right? Entonces, podemos okay. decir que hardly ever... Rarely and seldom que andar en un 25%, 30% los tres. All right, usted puede jugar con hardly ever, casi nunca, rara vez, que es lo mismo, casi nunca, rara vez, y seldom también es rara vez. Entonces, esos tres lo vamos a ocupar como, um, como sinónimos, ¿ok? All right. Ok, thank okay. you. Yeah, very good. So here it says examples. A ver, Jasmine, can you please read the three examples? We, we often change the menu. We also give away promo, promotional items. They regularly select the new option. Very good. All right, thank you, Jasmine. So we often change the menu. We always give away promotional items. And number two, they regularly select the new products, okay? Aquí pusieron ellos otro adverbio de frecuencia que es regularly, que no está arriba, but that's okay. El regularly sería arriba del sometimes, all right? Por lo que seldom, rarely, hardly ever va abajo, okay? Vamos a detener aquí un segundito, toma asistencia. All right, let's see. Um, Carlos Roberto Garcia Ramirez. Okay, Carlos Gualberto Rodriguez. Present. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present. Domingo Alexander González. Present. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Eh, Fátima Alejandra Centeno Franco. Y 
Gilmar Cruz Méndez Méndez. Present teacher. Thank you. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jonathan mm. Alexander Pineda Díaz. Jorge Elvir Miranda Ramos. Present. Good evening. Good evening. José Francisco Hernández Ábalos. Present. I'm here. Yes, thank you. Carla Benacir Lara González. Present. Marco David Velázquez Vázquez. Present. María Melina Iraeta de Salinas. Present, teacher. Maritza Alcira Casellón Celaya. Good evening, present. Good evening, teacher. thank you. Thank you, Misael Rivera Aquino. Nancy Lisset Rodríguez Escoto. Romeo Alexis Rodríguez Joaquín. Jasmine Melanie Lemus Rodríguez. Present teacher. Marlon Alberto Cardona Valencia. Present. Thank you, Marlon. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present. Adela Trinidad González Consuegra. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. Thank you. All right, Amilcar Cañengues Aceituno. Present. Okay, very good, thank you. Oh, Fatima's coming in. All right. Okay, very good. Uh, let me see, anybody else is coming in right now? No, all right, very good. So here we have, guys, we have this um, questions or we have these sentences here on your book. Let me just share. All right, so here we have, it says, write set number five, write sentences about the activities you do at your workplace. Use the following adverbs of frequency to state how often you do these at those activities. We have always, rarely, hardly ever, seldom, sometimes, and never. Si usted me pregunta, teacher, pero yo entonces, ¿cuál pongo hardly ever, rarely, or, or seldom? All right? Entonces, podemos pensar, never, ya sabemos que es nunca. I would go with hardly ever. Luego iría rarely y luego iría seldom. Entonces, si lo tomamos de sometimes para abajo, después de sometimes yo pusiera seldom. All right, después pusiera rarely, hardly ever, y luego never. Así fuera como el porcentaje. Y el porcentaje cambia, like what? 3%, 5%, es bien cercano. Ok. So, I want you to think about activities that you do at your workplace. Not at your house, not at the church, not at the, at the class, at workplace. Think about an activity that you always do. Rarely, hardly ever, seldom, sometimes, and never. Escribanlas ahorita, please. Okay, you understand? Yes, teacher. Excellent. All right, let me know when you finish. Okay.
All right, finished or you need more time? More time. Okay, have... that's okay. Thank you. All right, guys, let's see. Um, Mariano, tell me or tell us uh, activities that you do at your workplace. I want you to tell me something with always and something with seldom. Mariano. Okay, teacher. All, I always write a report. Okay, very nice, okay. Seldom, I seldom stayed in my office. Oh, very good. So that means, Mariano, that you are in the field. Uh, that you're outside the office most yes, of the yes, time. I, okay. I, I, ah, interesting. Very nice. Okay, thank you, Mariano. Yeah. Very nice. Let's see. Okay. Marlon, rarely and never, Marlon. Okay, teacher. Rarely I arrive late at work. Excellent. Another one with never? I never send the report after the hour. Wow, very good, Marlon. Excellent sentences. Thank you. All right, let's see. What about Fatima? I don't know if you can participate, Fatima. Tell me one sentence with hardly ever and sometimes, Fatima. Okay, I sometimes make payments. Okay. 
and I hardly ever attend clients. clients. Attend clients. Oh, very good. Nice. Uh, uh, nice. Very good, Fatima. Thank you. Let's see. What about Alexander? Tell me with rarely and sometimes. And uh, uh, sometimes get to work early. Okay. Another one with um, the other adverb of frequency, Alexander, please. Tiene otra, Alexander, no. Uh, I seldom, I seldom, oh. I seldom be in house. No, oh, you're seldom. Okay, I am seldom at home. Okay, all right, interesting. Thank you. All right, let's see. What about Johnny? You choose Johnny. Um, maybe with hardly ever and always. He hardly, hardly ever is not busy. All right, okay. Uh, what is the other teacher? I think I said always. Always. Uh -huh. I always help to my partners in computing. All right, very good, Johnny. Solo quítale el tú. I always help my partners. Okay. All right, perfect, very nice. Yes, with computers, very nice. Okay, volunteers, dos voluntarios. To tell me sentences. Teacher. Okay, tell me. Me teacher. Después la compañera, okay? Eh, oui. Yes, go ahead. ¿De cualquiera? Yes, cualquiera. Ustedes cójalas. Ah, okay, muy bien. Eh, I seldom eat dinner at my workplace. Okay. Eh, una otra con always. Eh, yes, of course. Uh -huh. I always have lunch at my workplace. Oh, very nice. I like that sentence. Very good. Thank you. All right. Um, la compañera que dijo yo después. I couldn't see you, but yeah. I am never, I am never cool. You never? Never cool. Okay. I I always work from Monday. You always work Mondays to Friday. Ah, you always work from Monday to Fridays. Oh, very nice. Excellent. Thank you. All right. Okay. Very good, guys. Thank you. So here we have some examples. All right. Solo para recordarles, okay? When we talk about adverbs of frequency, we have the structure. Usually... We use the subject, I, you, we, they, the store, the, the office, my clients, como sea, the subject, and then we have the adverb of frequency, I always, they, never, you, usually, all right? Then we have, so it's subject plus adverb of frequency, and then the rest of the sentence, except sometimes. Sometimes you can have it at the beginning of your sentence, in the middle of your sentence or at the end of your sentence. Pero eso, por eso le llamamos que sometimes es una exception, okay? Because we don't, we, I mean, with sometimes we can change the position, all right? Oops, con always no. Por ejemplo, usted no puede decir always I go to the park. No, I always go to the park. Yes, no puede decir I go to the park always. No, you can do that. With sometimes, yes, yeah, sometimes I go to the park. I sometimes go to the park. I go to the park sometimes, okay? So sometimes you can move sometimes from position, okay? No with hardly ever, no with never, no with seldom, all right? Only right now, only with sometimes, okay? Yes, any questions? Do we have questions? 
No. Uh, teacher. Yes, Amilcar. For example, in una de mis oraciones yo había sí. puesto in my work, I rarely read to newspaper. Okay, I rarely see. In my work, I rarely, yes, that's fine, Amilka. Yep, very nice. Okay. Okay. Como usted mencionó, when it, it you say the position, uh -huh. the, the expression of frequency, mm -hmm. I, I think about the, pensé que era un error escribirla de esta manera. Porque guardé la estructura de I rarely. Exactamente. Usted puede tener algo adelante, lo cual lo tiene usted, ¿verdad? Porque, porque usted dice, at my work or in the school or with my family, we never, for example, um, fight. ¿Ok? Usted puede tener algo antes, pero después sigue la estructura. We or my family never fight. No problem, Amilcar. That's fine. Okay. okay, excellent. Thank you. All right, very good. Okay, so now this is what I want you guys to work on. We're going to go back to the book. It's here, and I want you to do number six. It says your turn. A ver, quien me lee esa, por fa, alguien que me la lea. Yes. Okay. Donde dice, look at the graph. Okay. Look at the graph showing how often three branch of the restaurant to promotional activities during a month. Continue. Continue, please. Reading. Okay. Then ask a, ask a classmate how often each branch does promotional activities. Write your classmate's answer in the chart below. All right, thank you, Francisco, very good. Okay, so it says, look at the graph. This is a graph, guys, okay? This is a graph, a bar graph, all right? Showing how often three branches, no tengamos miedo de pronunciar la ES, ¿verdad? Three branches of a restaurant do promotional activities during a month. Entendemos lo que es branches? No. Sucursal? Yes. Sucursal, en este caso sucursales. All right, okay. So three branches, okay. Igual depende del contexto, porque branch también puede ser rama, pero rama de un árbol. All right, all right. So you have branch. O marca, teacher. Ah, no, ese es brand. Okay. Ajá, very good. Get confused. Yes, that's okay. It's similar. <laughs> yeah. All right. Then it says, then, yes, you're welcome. Then ask a classmate how often each branch does promotional activities. Write your classmates' answers in the chart below. Let me just see something here. Which chart? Oh. Okay, that's fine. All right. So, we're talking about this um, chart here, the bar graph. So what I want you to do, van a estar exactamente lo que dice aquí. Look at the graph, se van a ir a sus grupos. Look at the graph showing how often three branches. Tenemos a branch, well, some branches here. Okay, so we have San Salvador, La Paz, La Unión, and Usulután. So we actually have four branches. All right, and then a look at the activities or the promotional activities during a month. You have to look at it, okay? Ask a classmate how often, entonces, if I'm working with Johnny, con los dos vamos a ver la gráfica, all right? Y vamos a decir, how often does San Salvador branch change the menus? All right? Y decimos, ah, they change the menus. Um, they usually change the menus, porque estamos como arriba, all right? Or si se fija, La Paz branch, how often they have new desserts? Ah, hardly ever. They hardly ever have new desserts. Entonces vamos a ir. Así voy a, voy a escribir una aquí. Para que nos guiemos con esta. How often... 
Does, porque es una, una sucursal, how often does the Usulutan branch promote items? All right, aquí está abajo, donde dice promotional items, ok? Entonces con Johnny, si estuviese trabajando con Johnny, dijéramos the, um, o solo Usulutan branch, si quiere Usulu Tan Branch promotes uh, a ver, sería que sometimes about that bueno, lo, lo que ustedes decidan cuál adverb frequency le van a poner vamos a poner sometimes aquí uh, Usulutan Branch sometimes promotes Items. Esa sería la respuesta. All right. Si gusta, tome la captura por cualquier cosa en lo que los mando. Ok. Ya. Yeah. ¿Estamos listos? ¿Listas? Yes. All right. Acuérdense, okay. Acuérdense que aquí dice look at the graph showing how three branches. Entonces tienen que hablar de, la, de cualquiera de las tres sucursales que hay. Ok. All right. Jugando con change the menu, rotate shifts, new desserts, promotional items. Tenemos San Salvador, La Paz, La Unión, en Usulután. All right. So you can change eh, questions and you can change the answers. Si no están, si usted quiere usar otro adverbio de frecuencia, como por ejemplo, usually, regularly, um, I don't know. The other ones, it's fine. La idea es que vaya haciendo la pregunta, respuesta y usando adverbs of frequency. Ok, voy a permitirles compartir pantalla. No sé por qué siempre tengo que hacer esto, porque antes no. <ríe> Solo con Johnny me pasaba. All right, very good. Los mando entonces. Pero ya, Johnny, hoy sí, ya. <laughs> ok. Thank you. All right, guys. Vamos, eh, los voy a mandar en, en pareja para que puedan ahí entre los dos o las dos hacer las preguntas y las respuestas. Van a tener las mismas. Respuesta y pregunta. Cada grupo puede tener cual, diferentes, pero entre ustedes dos son las mismas. All right. Francisco and Jorge.
Hola, Francisco. ¿Se le fue el Inter? Sí, me estaba fallando porque me sacó de la clase. Ah, ok. Eh, ¿Lo voy a mandar a un grupo? Oye. Please. Ok, ahorita. Espérame, Frank. All right, bye, Frank. Bye. Johnny, no. No puede ser, Johnny. <laughs> no. Hi. He's other. Ah, ok. No. <laughs> Tell me. Eh, a ver, eh, estas gráficas, disculpe sí. la ignorancia. No, tranquilo. Por ejemplo, eh, en la, la gráfica de San Salvador, la primera. Sí. Cuando, cuando el gráfico llega hasta el 34 y uh -huh. su título abajo dice cambio de menú. ¿Cómo debo entender esta gráfica? Que ha hecho cambios en el menú como por 34 veces en el mes. O... Ajá, a eso me quiero referir. ¿Qué me están diciendo las sí, gráficas a mire, partir de los días? Ahorita voy, no se preocupe porque a mí también me da así como, ajá. A ver, ahorita voy. Es que la gráfica está como rara, pero, pero ahorita, ahorita comparto. Yo entiendo a Milgar y Johnny. Uh -huh. I'm not an expert, pero yo entendería por cómo está la gráfica que 16 es como lo más, lo más frecuente, que eso sería como always. Sí. ¿Verdad? Y cero es ah, never, ¿verdad? Sí. Entonces, por ejemplo, si nos vamos a la gráfica de Change the Menu y nos vamos a, a la unión, el verdecito, y tenemos un 8, yo le diera sometimes, tomando en cuenta que 16 está como que fuera el número mayor. El tope. Ajá, entonces para mí 16 fuera always. 8 fuera sometimes y cero obviamente es never. Y de ahí juego. Yo así lo haría, Milka. <risa> Tiene razón. Así es como debe hacerse, teacher. Es ¿eh? correcto. Thank bueno, you. You're welcome. Johnny, ¿está bien con eso? ¿No sería así, Johnny? Yo digo que sí, Johnny. Sí, ese análisis así sería. ¿Verdad? Y otra preguntita. Otra preguntita. A partir de lo que dicen al pie de las gráficas, nos sí. vamos a seguir por esos cambios al hacer las preguntas. ¿verdad? Exacto, sí. ¿Verdad? Usted puede decir, escoja, por decir, escogen la unión en la primera pregunta. Entonces decimos, vaya, la unión y sobre promotional items. Entonces okay. va a decir, how often eh, does la unión promote items? ¿Verdad? Porque lo tenemos que convertir en verbo. En lugar de promotional items decimos promote items. ¿Cierto? Okay. Entonces ya la respuesta sería a ah, la unión promotes o, o promotes items sometimes si quiere poner sometimes o la unión eh, usually podríamos poner usually aunque no está adentro pero ya lo sabemos usually promotes items ok entonces vamos jugando con los adverbios de frecuencia mil carillones Okay. Okay. Yep, you're welcome. Teacher, una Hola. question. Dígame. Ajá. Porque a veces se oye como eco. Aquí. Ah, de repente oigo doble. Yo hablo y de repente se escuchan de usted otra vez. Ah, no sé, Johnny. Pero yo lo oigo clarito. <risa> ah, pues yo escucho doble. Oye, cabal, ya escucho otra vez. No, es un eco. Es un eco que, que se oye del lado de la teacher. Por el ah. fondo de, de, de música ambiente que pone ella. Ah, <ríe> y no sé ni cuál, porque es mi vecino. <ríe> ah. All right, very good. Okay. ok, cualquier cosa me avisan. Ok. Hello.
Hello, teacher. Hi, Francisco. Lo volvió a sacar. Es que ni siquiera me dejó entrar. No sé qué pasa. Me gusta no, que no lo vuelva, si lo vuel sí, ha de ser porque todos los demás están bien. Usa que lo intentamos nuevamente, Frank, lo vuelvo a mandar. Vaya, por bueno, porque se, se queda cargando, como que va a entrar, mm. pero al final no, no. no entra, ok. Va. Hola, Jennifer. Hi, teacher. Hi. Se salió. Es que mi compañera, no parecer, no estaba conectada. Trini era, ¿verdad? Sí. Vaya. ¿La voy a mandar a otro grupo? Está bien. ¿Le logró abrir Jennifer el otro grupo? No. No, pero aquí hay una opción. Le voy a dar de entrar a sesión ah, okay. de grupo pequeño. Ok, perfecto.
Hi, Francisco. Hello. No sé por qué, pero no es el internet. Sí, bien raro, ¿verdad? Ha de ser ah. la plataforma por alguna razón. Solo déjeme un ratito, permítame. A lo mejor. De acuerdo, está bien. Ok. Entonces, no sé si escuchó las instrucciones, Frank. Sí, ¿verdad? ¿Estaba sí. cuando di las instrucciones para ir a los sí. grupos? Sí. Ok. Sí. Entonces, si gusta, hagámoslo aquí una, dos, porque ya voy a ir cerrando igual los grupos. So, tenemos acá. Entonces, let's look at the chart, Francisco. All right. So, the idea is that you ask, we ask a question about any of the branches. All right. Using yes. how often, ¿verdad? So, um, choose one branch, uh, Francisco, and then one activity. Okay, for example, the, the La Union branch. Okay. Um, for example, uh, how often uh, La Union branch rotate chief? Okay, how often does, verdad? How often does the Union branch Rotate shift. Uh -huh. Rotate. It's, uh, ¿cómo sería? It's shift o it's solo shift. shift. Las dos cosas, de las dos formas podríamos hacerla. Ajá, All como right. sus su horarios. Su, exacto, sí. Ajá. Entonces yo le podría decir la unión, ¿verdad? Dijimos. Yes. La unión branch. Sometimes rotate its shifts. All right, because yeah. it's innate, okay. It's, yeah. uh, what is night? Excuse me? What is night? Uh, you I said, said night? rotate. No, 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 I said uh, the union branch sometimes rotate. I said rotate. Uh, it's okay. shift, uh-huh. All right, very good. Let's do another one, uh, Frank. Okay, for example, the branch, la, la, no, sería La Paz Branch. That's uh, right, yes. For example, uh, how often uh, those La Paz run, Branch uh, new dessert, dessert is ice cream, like ice like, like, like postre, yeah, uh huh. Ahora, necesitamos un verbo, Frank. Ah, ok. Das, la past branch, ¿qué? Uh, give, regalar. Give, give new dessert or have new dessert. Yes, cualquiera podría ser, ok. Uh, ok. We can say la past branch. Rarely. <laughs> Rarely um, gives out new dessert. Ok. Give. Gives, gives out give, es como regalar. De uh, dar, yes. Uh -huh. All right, very good, nice. Okay, one more. The last one, more. one, Frank, yes. The last one, yeah. Um, San Salvador branch. Okay. Uh, how often uh, those change the menu, San Salvador branch? Mm, Otra vez, Frank, hágala bien. Es que ajá, me, me estoy confundiendo un poco. Ajá. <ríe> Sería, how often the San Salvador branch change the menu? Ok, how often, how often does? How often does the San Salvador does. branch change the menu? Ajá. Ajá. Yeah, all right, very good. Acuérdense que va primero el, el auxiliar, ¿verdad? How often, la, pre, la pregunta, how often does? Auxiliar. Y luego, el, ajá, y luego el sujeto. Ajá. Uh -huh. Very good. Yes, very good. So how often does San Salvador branch change the menu? Um, San Salvador branch usually changes the menu. Usually. Yeah. yeah. All right. Very good. Yes. Excellent, Frank. Very good. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for yeah. helping. Yes, of course. <laughs> Uh, for helping, uh, no, helping, sería. For helping, yes, yes, of for course. Help. You're very welcome. 
Okay, okay. voy a cerrar. The, okay. The, the groups. All right, everyone finished? Yes, so so. Mm, so, so yeah. yeah, all right, let's see. Uh, let's see, Marco, David, who did you work with, Marco? He, Velasquez. <laughs> este, uh, no sé cómo, no me fijé el nombre. <laughs> Marco, ¿qué le pasó, Marco? Yo solo sé que tiene el apellido igual que el mío, Velasquez. Ah, she's, a, she's a teacher. Johnny. No. No, he. he. No, he. She's a teacher. Uh, All right, that's okay, know. that's okay, that's okay. Ya entró, no ha entrado. No lo ve por ahí. A Mirker, ¿cómo va la selecta, Mirker? Uh, ah, eso le iba a preguntar. Van, compañeros. Victoria María Vázquez. Oh, all right. So you're working with you're working with Victoria. Están hablando de la selecta, niños. Concéntrense en la clase, por favor, sí. All right. Yo solo oigo que Marco me está tratando de decir algo y todos hablando de la selecta. All right, selecta is playing. Allá están en Canadá hablando. Ah, no están aquí. ¿Dónde están ahora? A ver dónde están. Váyanse ahorita a ser traductores. Very good, Marco. A ver. Entonces, give me one question, Marco. All right, uh, one question. So sorry. Um, how often does the La Paz branch, uh, La, La Paz branch promote items? Okay. Um, La Paz branch. La, La Paz branch. Usually promote items. Okay, very nice. Thank you. All right, nice. I like that one. Very good. Uh, let me see. Daniel, tell me the question. Y con quien haya trabajado me da la respuesta. Okay, I'm work with Marlon. Okay. Um, how often San Salvador branch change the menu? Daniel, how often does San Salvador branch change the menu? Yeah. Yes, okay. Aha, uh -huh. Marlon. Well, San Salvador branch sometimes change the menu. Oh, very nice. Okay, thank you. All right, perfect. Mariano, who did you work with Mariano? Maritza. Maritza. Okay, yes, okay. So Mariano, you ask the question and Maritza, you answer. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Maritza, how often La Union branch rotate chief? Uh, Mariano, how often does? Does. Uh-huh, very good. Maritza? Maritza me está diciendo la respuesta, pero en silencio. <laughs> Sorry, teacher. That's okay. La Unión Brian Seldon Rotate Chief. The Union brand, uh -huh. seldom rotates shifts. Very good. Okay. Elvir, do you ask the question? Who did you work with, Elvir? Uh, work with just me and Melina. And Maria Melina. Oh, perfect. Okay. So, Elvir, you ask the question and then Maria Melina answers and then you ask another question, Elvir, and Jasmine answers. Okay. Okay. Uh, who often doesn't the Usulatan branch change the menu? Uh, the Usulatan branch 
sometimes change the menu. Sometimes changes the menu. All right, very good. Elvir, the other question for Jasmine? Yes. Who often doesn't the San Salvador branch promotional item? Ah, Elvir, ¿y el verbo en esa, en esa pregunta cuál sería? El verbo, oh, creo que no lo comimos. <risa> ok. Sorry, no lo comimos aquí. No, pongámosle uno, no se preocupe, pongámosle uno. Is promotion, promotion no is change for... No. Often does. It would be promote. Promote. Promote, ajá. Es que es, es estábamos oh, pensando si era promote o era promotional. No, promotional is a noun. O que be like an adjective too, but it's not a verb. Promote is the verb. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, this moment to change the piece. Teacher, if for a promotional items, we can ask how often does La Paz branch give promotional items? Also, yes, you can, yeah, you can <laughs> go with promote, <laughs> give, correct. sell. Uh, give away. Yeah, it's correct, Daniel. You can play with many, many verbs. Yes. Okay, thank you. All right. So, how often? What was what was the branch? Elvir San Salvador, verdad? San Salvador branch promote uh, promotional know. items. <laughs> All right. Okay, very good. Uh -huh, Jasmine? San Salvador branch always promotes promote items. Okay, San Salvador branch always promotes items. All right, very nice. Okay, Fatima, tell me your question. Who did you work with, Fatima? With Hilmar. I work with Hilmar. Okay, so Fatima, you uh, ask the question and Hilmar yeah. answers the question. Okay. How often does the La Union branch change the menu? La Union branch hardly ever change the menu. Okay, changes the menu. All right, very good. Okay, thank you. All right, what about um, Romeo? Uh, Domingo. Ah, okay, with Alexander, very good. Okay, so Romeo, you ask the question and Alexander, you answer. Okay, how often does the change the menu? Okay. Uh, La Paz Bryce seldom changes the menu. Okay, changes the menu. All right, very nice. Amilcar with Johnny. Amilcar, you ask the question and Johnny answers. Okay, how often does change the menu San Salvador branch? Mm, Amilcar, reestructuremos esa pregunta. Uh, ah, okay, okay, sí, es how often does, uh, a ver, how often does the, does change the menu San Salvador branch? No, el sujeto va antes, Amilcar. How often does? Ahí va el sujeto. Does um, San Salvador uh -huh. branch change the menu? Excellent. Very good, Amilcar. Yes. Okay. Nice. Thank you. Uh -huh, Johnny? San Salvador branch usually change the menu. Changes the menu. All right. Very good. Yes. A ver, ¿qué me falta? Que no haya participado. Carlos o Alberto, yes, o todavía no? No, teacher. No. Who did you work with, Carlos? With Jorge. Oh, ok. Ah, solo que Jorge, no sé si está por ahí. Jorge está por ahí. All right, that's fine. Do you make the question, Carlos? Ok. ¿Sabe, sabe qué? Hágasela a Francisco. Oh, a Francisco. Uh -huh. Often La Paz branch promote new dessert. How often uh, does? Does the uh huh? 
Often does La Paz branch promote new dessert? Okay, La Paz branch promotes uh, new desserts rarely. Okay, ¿a dónde va a poner el rarely, Francisco? ¿Hasta el final? Uh, I'm sorry. No, it's okay, it's okay. And La Paz branch rarely changes, uh, and rarely promotes uh, new desserts. Excellent, very good, Francisco. Yes, excellent, thank you. All right, very nice. ¿Qué me falta? Carla, did you participate already, Carla? No, Miss. Okay, ¿con quién trabajo, Carlita? Eh, con... Ever. Ever, all right, very good. So, Carla, you make the question and Ever answers. Okay, uh, how often does San Salvador branch include new desserts? San Salvador branch sometimes include new desserts. Very good, Ever. Yes, en el caso de ustedes que están jugando con sometimes, ese sí lo hubieran pod uh, podido poner al final, ¿verdad? Y no hubiera habido problema, okay? That's fine. Sometimes it's, it's changeable, interchangeable in positions. Very good. Everybody else finished. Yes. Hola. Acerca de acerca de sometimes. Ajá. Lo puedo poner al final y lo puedo poner al así de la otra forma. Sí, en medio también. Ah, okay. ¿Y cuál era el otro? Sometimes in no, ahorita, De hecho, ahorita solo estamos viendo el sometimes que puede ser intercambiable en posición. Uh -huh. Ok. All right. Sí. Very good. Yes. Teacher. Yes. Uh, the, uh, what is different the, the rally or rally, no sé. Uh, uh, hardly ever. Um, there's no much difference, Alexander. La, la verdad que la diferencia es bien mínima. All right, entre hardly ever y eh, rarely and seldom. No, bueno. Como que bien poca. All right, but uh, de hecho pusieron una foto ahí. No sé si estaba esa incluida. Quiero ver uh, en el grupo. Yes. Ajá. Hardly ever tiene un 5 por si se fija. Hardly ever y rarely tiene un 5%. Según el mismo manual, all right, de los oh. cursos anteriores. Y el seldom tiene un 10%. Por eso les decía cuando teníamos los eh, just the words. Después de sometimes para mí iría seldom, all right, hardly ever, and um, rarely y van como casi a la par. All right, es uno, uno más, uno menos, but it's pretty much the same, Alexander. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Very nice. Okay. Yes, Johnny. I have a question with the questions. <laughs> For example, okay. how often does the San Salvador or put off the? How often does? Lo que pasa que estamos diciendo the branch. All right. So in that case, we could say the San Salvador's branch, but. I think I would take it off, Johnny, and I would say how often does San Salvador branch? All right, lo que pasa es que cuando decimos does the San Salvador branch, estamos hablando específicamente de esa sucursal, de San Salvador. So in that case, we can say that San Salvador branch. Yes. The case is the La Paz. Mm -hmm. Does da La Paz. How often does, uh, how often does, the La Paz branch, uh-huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, Thank very you. good. Yep, very nice. Thank you. All right, so I'm going to take the attendance of this time. Maybe just give me a second here. Yeah, that was a nice picture there. All right, let's see. So, Carlos Roberto Garcia Ramirez. Oh. Carlos Walberto Rodriguez. Alberto, yes, thank you. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present. 
Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. <coughs> Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Presente. Fátima Alejandra Centeno Franco. Present teacher. Gilmar Cruz Méndez Méndez. Present teacher. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jonathan Alexander Pineda Díaz. Jorge Elvir Miranda Ramos. Present. José Francisco Hernández Ábalos. Present teacher. Carla Be Benacir Lara González. Present. Marco David Velázquez Vázquez. Present. María Melina Iraeta de Salinas. Present, teacher. Maritza Alcira Castellón Celaya. I'm here, teacher. Misael Rivera Aquino. Present, teacher. Thank you. Nancy Lisset Rodríguez Escoto. Romeo Alexis Rodríguez Joaquín. Present. Jasmine Melanie Lemus Rodríguez. Present, teacher. Marlon Alberto Cardona Valencia. Present. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. Adela Trinidad González Consuegra. Doria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. Ok, Ana Milcar Cañengues Aceituno. Present. Me, no, me, me eh, falté alguien de mencionar o todos los mencioné. ¿Estamos bien? All right, ok. Yes, so let's, thank you. All right, so let's continue then here with the graph. Ok. Now, let's go now here. I'm going to make it smaller. It says unit two. We keep on talking about unit two. I will be able to. Let's see. Um, Fatima, can you read? I don't they say I will be able to, Fatima. Okay. Real collective schedule showing basic and common tasks, tasks in a restaurant. Talk about the schedule activities at my workplace. Thank you. All right. Very good. All right. And then number one, it says, let's start. What the estimated time an employee works a day in your workplace? Does everybody have a specific schedule to follow? All right. Now, for you guys, for anybody, how many hours a day do you work? Eight hours. Eight hours, Maria Melina? Yes, teacher. Okay, anybody else? In my else? case, teacher, in my case, I work 12 hours. How many, uh, wow. Daniel? 12. Wow. 12 hours, okay, yes, yes, very good. Someone else? In my case, I work seven hours. Okay, Johnny, very good. Yes. Anybody else? Todos andamos like about eight hours? Yes. Yeah? Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you. Okay. So now here we have this. We are going to read this conversation. All right. A ver, Amilcar, can you be Ben? And Marco, can you be Matthew? Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, man. I believe, believe that everybody is hard today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? ¿Perdone? Ah, y termina en weekend, ¿verdad? No, sí, sí son no. according. According okay. to the schedule, Mark. Mm -hmm. Perdón. No. No, creo que es que está muy abajo el, el, 
El nombre. No, I... Matthew according. Okay. According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shift. All right. Very good. Thank you. All right. Let's see. What about Elvir? Can you be Ben? And Walberto, can you be Matthew? Okay. Hey, Matthew. Who is going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and the late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark. And Sophie had the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay, thank you, Mark. See you. <laughs> thank you, guys. <laughs> Very good. Mariano, can you please be Ben? And let me see here. Victoria, can you be Matthew? Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic you know. You're right. Look, who has the early to late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon chief, and Tom and Kate have the evening chief. Excellent, thank you. All right, very good. So it says, hey, Matthew, how is it going? No, it's Hoover, that's how. How is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody's here today because of traffic, you know? You're right. Look, who has the early and late shifts for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay? All right, recuerde que cuando decimos shift es eh, jornada o la. Turno. Turno. No me salía el turno, all right? De la mañana, de la tarde, de la noche, all right? So that's shift, okay? Do you understand relieved? No. No? Anybody? Es como aliviado. Me siento aliviado que todos están aquí. All right. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of traffic. It's a verb. Uh, no, it's an adjective. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody, everything else is okay for this conversation, yes? Okay, if you have no questions, then let's go to um, exercise three, it says fair work. Look at the schedule at a restaurant and answer the following questions. Number one, who manages the restaurant? And number two, who cooks, okay? Let me just see something here. All right, so this is what we're going to do, guys, here. I want you to work on exercise three, that you're going to talk about this schedule. All right, answer the question, who manages the restaurant and who cooks? Igual, just to practice, I need you to answer with full answers. No solo me va a poner Linda. Or Gustavo, no, I want the whole sentence. I want a full sentence for number one and number two, based on this. When you finish, all right, I want you to this, do this sentence, I mean, these questions, and answer them. Okay, esto es de acuerdo a esto de aquí. All right. So we're, we're working on page 23 and page 24. Voy a dejar de compartir. Eso lo tienen en el manual, ¿ok? Seguimos en los mismos grupos. Um, Frank, 
Vamos a intentar que se vaya a su grupo, si no, igual, trabajamos aquí. De acuerdo. Marlon al Francisco, ¿no? Tampoco me dejó. ¿Qué le es que se, queda, <risa> se queda cargando y no entra al grupo nunca. Sí, ¿verdad? Bueno, ok. Ajá. Entonces, veamos aquí. Una ¿Qué duda. Diga. Eh, al otro día hice... Ah, me acabo de dar cuenta que lo puedo hacer. El que estaba haciendo las tareas de la plataforma. Uh -huh, ajá. Pero no sé por qué no, no me dejaba así como, no me, no me parecían buenas, digamos, cuando uh -huh. las había hecho buenas porque las resolvimos. Sí. Entonces, creo que alguien, a alguien más también le pasó eso. Uh -huh. Y lo corrieron. Pero, ¿Y las tiene la bien? ¿Ya las tiene bien o todavía le siguen saliendo mal? Es que, por ejemplo, eh, sí están bien, pero me las muestra como que están malas. Enséñame no la. Sé. Mira si puede compartir. ¿Puede mm. compartir su pantalla? No. No, no puedo. Ah, es que está en otro pero, dispositivo. Ajá. Ah, ok. Eh, ¿Cuáles son? ¿Cuáles son, Frank? No, no hay problema. ¿Cuáles son? Vaya, son cuando estábamos usando el Cool B. Uh -huh. Entonces, por ejemplo, each opportunity will be a great. Permítame, a vamos great. a buscarlas aquí. Give me a second. Aquí las busco, a ver. 
Uh, it would be a great opportunity to study abroad, ESA. Aha, uh vaya, -huh, yes. It would be a, a great, great opportunity to, to study abroad. Y luego punto final, Frank. Ah, el punto final me hizo falta. Sí. Porque el punto final no les había puesto ningún. Ajá, tiene que ponerle punto final, si no se la pone mal. Intente así con punto. ¿Se lo agarró? No, es, me parece la X. El IT lo puso con mayúscula. Ah, es otra vez. Sí. Opportunity con doble P. Sí, pero es que no sé por qué me sale mal. Porque está bien, o sea, lo estoy viendo así con, comparando. Uh -huh. Y está bien. Ah, no, aquí hay un reras. Había puesto a Brad. Eso había puesto mal. Sí, pero bueno, ahorita le volví a dar a enviar. Y me la pone mal. Mire así. Ahorita se la estoy poniendo aquí en el chat. Y would be. Uy, espérame, espérame, espérame. It would be a great opportunity to study abroad. Mire si la tiene así. Ahorita la puse aquí en el chat de Zoom. Uh, it would be a great opportunity. Great opportunity. Study abroad. Sí, exactamente. Qué raro. Sí. Porque ajá, no, no. Me parece raro que cuando las hice me salió mal. Mm -hmm. Pensé que estaban bueno. Sí. Pero vaya, ahorita la tarea parece como me parece ya como realizada. Ya. Y le aparece con cuánto de por ciento, cuánto porcentaje, eh, con cero porque todas están malas. ¿Y será que no le está poniendo algo, Frank? Porque no las puede tener malas todas. <risa> Lo dejo, pues, pero las voy a volver a hacer. No voy a volver a salir de todo. Uh -huh. ¿Y las cinco le salían malas? Sí. Todas las, veces, las veces que la hice me salieron mal. Ahorita las iba a corregir, pero igual, no está real. Sí. Y no le está poniendo ni doble espacio o algo, porque todas esas cositas es como que las toma mal. Ajá. No. 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 Pero sí, no, todo está bien. Estoy viendo si más mayúsculas, pero no. Y el punto sí dice que se lo puso. Ajá. Es saber en qué está. Sí. Y refrescó la página, Francis. Sí. Pero está fallando. Uh
Pero, ajá, yo preguntaba porque creo que eso es como una nota, ¿verdad? Sí, lo que pasa es que le va a salir como que no está completada. O sea, le va a salir como que tiene 0%, ¿verdad? Porque si las tiene malas, si se las está tomando como malas. Uh -huh. Lo raro es que ninguna le está tomando, ni una sola. Ajá, porque, bueno, por ejemplo, por ejemplo, la otra que sería a, a training could be por ejemplo, training could be mm -hmm. our our beneficial. A training could be beneficial for our employees. Uh, yeah. oh. Oh. El punto también. Sí, y el A mayúscula, ¿verdad? A training could be beneficial for our employees. Mm -hmm. Ah, es así, me dijo. Es así. Sí. Ya lleva bueno, una. Es, <ríe> no, 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 no. Y la tres, ¿cómo la tiene? La tres dice working less hours. Okay. Will be another. Ah, que alguien que no estuviese hablando de la escritura. No, de, bueno. Ahí está, un montón. Ah, entonces es algo pasado. El punto era. Ajá. Uh -huh. And by weekends, weekend out. Ah, tenía una pregunta. Una, la palabra faith, faith, uh -huh. ¿qué significa? Um, como destino. Fate? No, faith. Ah, faith. Con, con TH. No, con D. F-A-D-E. Ah, fade. Um, fade. Fade away es como desvanecerse. Ah, ajá, sí, claro. Pero diluirse, no. También, sí. Ah, ok. Could be. Uh -huh. Ok, hoy lo vi. Y como no tenía traductor, no sabía ver. <risa> Francisco, where do you work? Ahí veo su camisa. Sí, por eso me conecto despuesito porque vengo en el bus. Ajá. Ajá. But you live here in San Salvador, Francisco? Sí. Okay. And you work in Vidri, San Salvador? ¿O no? No. In which branch do you work? Ah, the. Escalón Branch. Oh, okay. Yes. All right. And I'm living in San Okay. No le queda muy lejos. Mm, no, but the traffic is yeah. very hard. I know. Yes. It's difficult. Yes, it is. It's more, it's more stressful. It is very stressful. I'm very happy teaching online. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I don't have to commute. It's, it's better. 
it you? is yes it is better for me <laughs> <laughs> And, and you, uh, come on, say it. Uh huh. Do you work? Do you work all day? Um. Yeah, pretty much. I teach at university in the mornings. Online. Uh, yeah, everything That's is online. online. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah. I teach at UCA and I teach at Evangelica online. Uh -huh. to university mm -hmm. uh, yes it's, it's funny for you I like it I like teaching <laughs> uh, yes but uh, oh, uh, you are busy you are busy uh, all day. Yes, pretty much. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. Uh, and for you, it's very easy to teach online because the yes. uh, said to commute. To, to commute. commute. Mm -hmm. To commute uh, the. The, ¿cómo se dice? De una, de un lado a otro. Uh -huh. From one place to the next. Yeah. I like teaching online. <laughs> <laughs> yes, a lot. I love you. Love you yeah. work. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Especially now that I, I don't have to commute anymore. I'm I'm home all the time. I like that. All yes. right. Yes. Voy a cerrar los grupos para ver cómo van estos chicos. Okay. Mariano, did you finish? Mariano, hola, Mariano. Ah, uh, sorry. That's yeah. okay. Yes, sir. Excellent, very good. All right, guys, so let's see. We are going to check the questions here. So here we have number one, who manages the restaurant? Maritza, aha, Maritza, tell me answer number one. Who manages the restaurant? Um, Jennifer Rodriguez is the manager of the restaurant. Okay, Jennifer Rodriguez is the manager of the restaurant or alguien más escribió diferente? Yes, teacher. Dame, Milka. Yes, teacher. Uh, manage, manages the restaurant. Is Jennifer Rodriguez. Dígame la otra vez, Amilka. Manages the restaurant. ¿Quién? Jennifer Rodríguez manages the restaurant. Ah, ok. All right, very good. Okay. Jennifer <laughs> Rodríguez. No. I read it different. Uh -huh. Ok, ya la vamos a ver. <laughs> Jennifer Rodríguez manages the restaurant. Yes, that's ok. Very good, Emilcar. Yes. A ver, okay. ¿alguien más dijo? ¿Tenía diferente? Mi, mi okay. tres. En uh, the group, the manager of the restaurant from... 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. is Jennifer Rodriguez. Excellent. Okay. All Teacher, right. uh, 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 manager, uh, yes, pardon. Jennifer Rodriguez is manager of the restaurant. Jennifer Rodriguez? Is the manager 
the restaurant. Is the manager of the restaurant. Okay, that's uh -huh. another possibility. All right, is the manager of the restaurant. Yeah. Okay, podemos jugar con varios tipos de respuesta and they are okay. Very nice. Thank you. Number two, who cooks? Uh, I, I write from 10 a.m. to 3.30 p.m. Kevin and Karen do cook at the restaurant. Okay, they cook at the restaurant. Okay, they cook. Kevin and Karen, right? Yes. Okay, any other answer, guys? Yes. Yes, yes. what do you have, Elvin? And the group writing. Mm -hmm. The cooks from the first chief are Kevin and Karen Dooley. Excellent. And second chief are Mateo, Luz, and Linda Harris. Excellent. Very good, Elvira. Nice. Elvira and the group. Very nice. Okay. Any other possibility, guys? The teacher is yes. the pupil cooks are Kevin Dooley, Karen Dooley. Karen Wilkins and Linda Harris. Okay, all right. So the cooks of the restaurant are it. Decimos la lista: Kevin, Karen, Mateo, and Linda. Okay. No, no, yes. All right, very good. Sure. Yes. And a group put in in the morning shift. The brothers Julie are in a turn to cook. Okay. And then up. After shift, Mateo Luz and Linda Harris take the kitchen. Oh, very nice. Excellent. Yes, that's another possibility. Okay. I like those answers. Very good. Well done, guys. Very nice. Number three, it says, who is in charge of wait, um, waiting tables in the morning shift? Who is in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift, guys? Who is in charge? Uh, Walter Olmo and Matthew Tour. I have Walter Olmo and Matthew Tour are in charge of waiting tables in the morning. Okay, yes. Solo que hay un micrófono abierto y no me deja oír bien. Um, Marco, can you tell me again your answer? Right. Walter Omo and Matthew Tool are in charge of waiting tables in the morning chill. Okay, are in charge of waiting tables, yes. Okay, very nice, thank you. Number two, who is in charge of managing the restaurant? En la misma de la número uno, right? We only have one manager, Jennifer uh, Rodriguez, very good. Number th yes. Number three. Who is in charge of the kitchen? Otra vez the same. In the morning shift. Es la, es la misma teacher. Yeah. Kevin and Karen Dooley. Yes, thank you. All right, very good. Who is in charge of taking orders? In the morning, the morning shift. In the morning shift, Emil and Carlos takes the orders. Jorge Milano. Ah, Carlos, Carlos and Jorge Milano, okay. No, Carlos Guardian uh -huh. are in charge of taking orders. Okay, are in charge. All right, no, in charge or no, in charge. Are in charge of taking orders. Very good. And then we have, what does Matthew do? Matthew is a waiter in the morning shift. Yeah, my Matthew is a waiter or he waits tables, right? Okay. Huh. What about Gustavo? What does Gustavo do, guys? Gustavo Wandike. What does he do? He's in charge of oh, he's in charge of order take care in the in the evening shift. Okay. Yeah, all right. He's in charge of taking orders at the evening shift. Okay. What about Oscar Sagrario? He is waiting in the afternoon shift or evening shift. 
Yes, all right, very good. Okay, perfect. Let's see. All right, give me a second, guys. Apagar el micrófono a Milka. All right, okay. Sigue engañado a Milka. Ay, a Milcar, todos, a Milcar, a Milcar, reaccione a Milcar. <risa> dice la Carlos. Ni, ni se había papel, dado eh. cuenta que we were talking about him. All right, ok, a ver, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Quiero que, similar a esto que está aquí, pero más corto, solo escoja, quiero ver. Escoja usted, you, su supervisor, or your boss, or the owner of the company. All right. Y un compañero o compañera más de trabajo. Ok. More or less, let's do a schedule. But about your work. Ok. Entonces usted, por ejemplo, dice, ah, bueno, qué, ¿de qué me encargo yo? Ah, de vender algo, ¿no? Entonces, sales. ¿De qué momento a qué momento hace ventas? ¿De qué momento a qué momento hace un inventario, por decir algo? ¿O quién hace el inventario en su empresa? All right, so think about people that work with you in the office and what do they do and what time do they do it? In the morning, in the afternoon, at night, ¿ok? Si usted quiere, sigue algo así como está acá o solo va escribiendo, por ejemplo, ah, my boss... Uh, keeps track of sales in the morning. Um, Mario goes to the bank at the end of the day every day. All right, entonces pensamos en actividades que se hacen and the schedule, si es in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, all right? Think about your job and the people that work with you at the office. Hacemos un par de oraciones, all right, and then we share antes de irnos. Definitivamente, el trabajo se trató de hacer, el resultado no se dio, y bueno, y Canadá entonces ahora se queja porque está con... Ah, ya perdió el salvador. Again. As always. <laughs> no way. Olmos. Dejémoslo así, dejémoslo en Olmos. <laughs> ok. Hoy hay varios con la cámara apagada. Recuerde que tenemos que tenerla encendida la mayor, el mayor tiempo posible. Thank you. Me, solo me estoy tomando una graciosa. No se preocupe, Elvir. I'm not saying it because of you. You always have it on. A ver, a ver, muestra las camisas que la selecta. Ajá, yeah. es que yo creo que están en el estadio. <risa> en el estadio. Está. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Excuse me. Eh, me podría salir unos cinco minutos antes eh, que, por problemas de salud. Ah, ok, Gilmar. <coughs> Gracias. 
en intensidad, en el cielo, no pero a veces ve y no se corona y dice, a la cosita, All right, Johnny, do you have some sentences done? Yes. All right, tell me some of your sentences, please. Okay. Margelin Suniga manages the school in the morning shift. Okay. Uh, Raul visits the bank in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. I teach computing from 7 a.m. to noon. Oh, okay. And Silvia cooks, cooks at mm -hmm. the school in the morning. Oh, very nice. Interesting. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Ever, tell us your sentences if you have them, Ever. Yes, teacher. I got it. Three. My boss got a meeting with our provider at morning. In the morning. In the morning. Yes. Okay. Humberto makes the sales report in the evening shift. Okay. And I am in a church to visit the customer in the morning shift. Ah, oh, okay. Customers. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you. Let's see. What about um, Daniel? Tell us your sentences, Daniel. Okay. Um, Rafael is driver on, um, in the morning shift. Okay. And Juan is the driver in the evening shift. Oh, okay. And Anna is the, the, like the, in, in our work, we have a office or position is named dispatch. dispatch. Okay, yes. And the people who is, la persona que realiza ese trabajo se le llama dispatcher. Okay. Okay, and Anna is, is the dispatcher in the morning shift. Ok, perfecto, thank you. All right, mañana cuando entremos vamos a escuchar algunas de las otras oraciones que ustedes acaban de realizar. I'm going to take the attendance so you guys can go. Carlos Roberto García Ramírez. Carlos Gualberto Rodríguez. Carlos Gualberto. Present. Thank you. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present, teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present, teacher. Edwin Eliseo Orellana Vivas. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Fátima Alejandra Centeno Franco. Present teacher. Gilmar Cruz Méndez Méndez. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jonathan Alexander Pineda Díaz. Jorge Elvir Miranda Ramos. Present. José Francisco Hernández Ábalos. Present teacher. Carla Benacir Lara González. Marco, Carlita, ¿no? All right. Uh, Marco David Velázquez Vázquez. Present. María Emelina Iraeta de Salinas. Present teacher. Maritza Alcira Castellón Celaya. Misael Rivera Aquino. Present teacher. Thank you. Nancy Lizeth Rodríguez Escoto. Romeo Alexis Rodríguez Joaquín. Present. Jasmine Melanie Lemus Rodríguez. 
Present. Present. Marlon Alberto Cardona Valencia. Present. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Mariano José Paca Santa María. I'm here to show. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present. Adela Trinidad González Consuegra. Present. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. Ah, yes, thank you. Ana Milcar Cañengues Aceituno. Present. All right, thank you guys so much. Hoy se me queda Ever un ratito. Luego mañana Fátima y Gilmar el viernes. All right. Everybody else, you may go. Thank you so much for joining class. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye now. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. See you guys. Bye now. Have a good night. You too. Same for everyone. Thank you. Ever, do you run? Hello, teacher. Hi, do you run? Yes. Yes. Ah, I like it. You like to run? Yes, yes. Very nice. Do you like to run full uh, marathons or half marathons? Twice. I I run uh, two marathons uh, right now for the lockdown. We cannot mm -hmm. run, but right. in the past, uh, the, the, mid, the, the, the mid marathon. Half, I, half marathon? I half marathon. Oh. I, nice. I run around, around to. 10, 10, half marathon and two marathons complete. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. The, prepara the preparation is this. I know. I know. Hard, hard. I used to run ever. And I don't run anymore, but I did for many, many years. For many years? Yes. How long time? Um, Many years, yeah, for a mentira ever, but um, <laughs> I, I run in grade seven, eight, nine, primer año, segundo año, tercer año, bachillerato. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. What do you, you live there? Excuse me? What, what, what do you live there? Por qué lo dejó? Ah, because I had an accident. I broke my ankle. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Training. Yeah. I I have a two injuries in my ankle. Mm -hmm. In my right ankle. Okay. I got I got intervention. Here. Oh really? Yes. I I I was a uh, I broke my ankle to the Yeah, me I too. Oh I know. Okay. <laughs> and 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 put other other ligaments in my in my neck um, oh. to four years and okay. I I try to start again. Uh-huh. Yes. I, yes, yes. I start slowly, slowly, but mm -hmm. sure. Yeah, yes. yeah. You know what? I, I I I miss running a lot. I love running very much. <laughs> oh, yeah. But then it just, you yeah. know, like Every day is like in the work, the family, and everything. But yeah, I run for like maybe ten years. Yes. Yeah, and I for run marathons for... and half marathons too. Two. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't miss them. I don't, do. Don't, don't miss them. Well, I do. Actually, I do. I wish I could oh. have the time to run again ever. <laughs> It's different because the, the adrenaline, what we feel in the moment to the trial to the other. Right. Uh, I, I run two, two types, two kinds to, to, to run, to, uh -huh. how do you say, asphalto, the way, the way, the way street, uh -huh, uh -huh, and, uh -huh. and the trail, mountain. Yeah. Okay. The, oh. the, the preparation is, is different. Yeah, it's different, yes. Yes, yeah. it's different. Yeah. But, it's amazing too. Uh, it is. It is. It's very the, nice. The mental graded so yeah. is is different. This is true for me. Mm -hmm. Everything mm -hmm. I run around eight or ten kilometers. Oh wow! Yeah. 
All right. Yes. Yes. But it's yeah. a style life. Uh, it, it is. It, that is a style life. I. Mm -hmm. No puedo pasar un día sin eso. Ajá. Sí, yo, I know, I know how that feels. <laughs> yeah. Sabe que I remember when I was in, um, I was in a team in my high school. I lived in Canada, right? So I was in, a, in my univer in my high school. I was in a team, and I train every yeah. day, every day for like two hours, every day. You know it, right? And then one morning I was sick. And my yeah, mom yeah. said, okay, don't go, don't go to your training because you are sick. But it's like, es una, es una necesidad, ¿verdad? <laughs> so it's like, mom, yeah, yeah. right? And, and yeah. at the end yeah. of the day, it was getting dark. And I said, mom, I feel fine. I want to go running, all right? So I went running, but it was dark. So I was running yeah, yeah. and there was a hole on the sidewalk and that's when i i put my foot and then i broke my ankle all right so your ankle your 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 how do you say tobillo yeah, my ankle yes oh, my ankle, your ankle, your ankle. Yeah. okay so i broke your it. Breath. so you i just put, you burned the place uh-huh you, you, you have a place in in, in the ankle mm -hmm. i know so and then yes. I just I run after that I I train again but then I came back to El Salvador so it was a little bit difficult it was different because he, running in Canada is very safe <laughs> but here it, it I found it very difficult at first I run for like I kept on running but after that I stopped and stopped and stopped and and I don't run anymore but I wish I could <laughs> Yes, I me my hand of the place is the is, is the place when you run and the Ghana I, I imagine to yeah with the ad adequate. Yes. The right place, yeah. Mm hmm And and here is like a ranger, like the <laughs> Iron Man. Yeah, no kidding. I know. Weird. I know, it's totally different. <laughs> yes, yeah. go to uh, esquivando, how they say esquivando? To move away. Yeah, to move away. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's it's totally different. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Very good. Oh, oh that's wow. nice. Yeah. But it's good that you run, yeah. ever. Very good. Yeah. I saw your shirt. That's why I asked you. Yes. <laughs> I have so many that yeah, I have. I yeah. run in San Miguel, in Santa Ana, and the Volcanes. Oh, nice. And, uh, Yes, and uh, uh, three years ago, no, mm -hmm. four years, no, three years ago, I ran in, in, in Chalate. Oh, the nice. Oh, wow. Yes. It's just to put the, the, the point to hike to the, wow. the, the country. Yes, yes. Wow. To the highest point. Oh, my goodness. That's very nice, Eve. Yeah. Yes. Uh, very good. Nice. It's a beautiful experience. I yes, it is. It is a beautiful experience for sure. Yes, very nice. Yes, you did. This is a, a little from my life in my free time. Excellent. Very nice. Good for you. <laughs> yeah. All right. Very good. Um, Eva, yeah. I'm. Uh huh. Tell me, tell me. No, 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 no. Tell me, tell me. I was just. Uh, I was gonna because we started talking about running, but I was gonna ask you if you have any questions about the classes or anything. Or for you're fine. Class, uh, we have to, for the no to the rules about the they use the off and in but and the last I just just played about this and I have some mistake around this okay about this okay. List. Okay. and this is no clear no more clear okay all right very good okay all right ever very good now we have we shared something today. <laughs> That's nice that we like to run. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. All right. Very good. Okay, Ever, I'm going to let you go so you rest. Thank you so much for staying, and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you, you, teacher. Thank you. Have a nice day. You Have too. a nice night. You too. Bye. Rest. Yes, good night.